automobile our channel of youtube on which we discuss about each and every part of an automobile so in order to that today we are going to discuss about a very interesting topic that is regenerative braking system guys the system is only used in hybrid or electrical kind of a vehicle regenerative braking is used for the recovery of kinetic energy guys during braking the kinetic energy is converted into the heat and released in the atmosphere means totally waste so guys that's why we use this regenerative braking system and and some part of uh, kinetic energy is converted into the electrical energy and again reuse so guys in order to learn about this interesting topic please sit back relax and watch our video till the very last second so guys our today's topic is regenerative braking system regenerative braking means recovery of kinetic energy during braking in a vehicle guys regenerative braking system is generally used in the hybrid or electrical vehicles and the basic parts of the system are electric motor brake pedal propeller shaft drive train two shafts which is also called drive shaft and the wheels high voltage battery and the controller so guys let's have a look on the working of regenerative braking system so guys when our vehicle is in moving condition and uh, deceleration is required at that time we press this brake pedal so when we press this brake pedal the electric motor is converted into the generator so guys as we all know about the electrical motor the motor consumes the electrical energy and convert it into the mechanical power but the generator gains the mechanical work and convert it into electrical energy so guys when the deceleration required we press the brake pedal and electrical motor converted into the generator and now drive is passed through drive wheel via drive train to the generator means the drive train takes drive from the drive wheel and it passes through the propeller shaft to the generator and the generator converts the mechanical work into the electrical energy and now this electrical energy is stored in the high voltage battery you can see here this is the sign of a battery charging that is continuously charging with the deceleration of a car and the, and this all system is controlled by this controller so guys this is the regenerative braking system and and at the condition of the permanent braking our vehicles are stopped with the help of friction brake system guys regenerative braking is only used for the deceleration not for the permanent braking guys generative braking torque which is a result of electrical motor to produce power is inversely proportional to the friction braking torque you can have a look here if generative braking torque is increased at that time friction braking torque is reduced but when the generative braking torque is reduced so friction braking torque will be increased so guys this is regenerative braking system with the help of the system we recover the energy reduce the braking wear low fuel consumption and lower co2 emission these are the advantages of regenerative braking system so thanks for watching guys that today's video that is regenerative braking system if you like this video and if you learn something from this video please give us a big fat thumbs up subscribe our channel and share with your friends so that they also can learn about the regenerative braking system